which would anger 49er fans more? Taking <laughs> Kyle Pitts or Panay Sewell, trading all that all, all that capital for a non-quarterback, or Mac Jones? McCorkle Jones. It's gonna be McCorkle Jones. I think it's the dude. Come on, man. Everyone's already everyone's already like <laughs> throwing throwing stink bombs at the idea already about, about McCorkle coming over here. I just want to keep saying McCorkle. Ever since we started <laughs> that two, three weeks ago on the live, man. I just been like I'm telling cousins McCorkle Jones at three. <laughs> but no, I think it's a hundred percent for McCorkle because at least like you know. <sighs> You know, the same thing you've been saying, Grant. They should go for Kyle Pitts. And it's like, I think in Pitts instead of Jones wouldn't be terrible. But right. I think the fan base, you know, the way it's going, the way they've been trashing him. We just said it like five, eight minutes ago. <laughs> the, the anger is going to be 24, 72 hour period. I would even go say it's farther than that because they just don't. It, Jones is not the sexy pick. You want that immediate impact player. Jones might not be it, at least not in my eyes, versus at least Pitts and Sewell. Like like you said, Pitts is better than George Kittle. I, I mean, I don't know if I can go that far, but at least those two, that's – oh, my God, that's twin towers right there. That's disgusting on that offense. And, and at that point, Garoppolo has a bunch of weapons. Or even Sewell, at least you get there. You got you get more – you can solidify the offensive line, which you saw if he actually had clean pockets, he was actually being able to deliver. So – I think in that sense they could they can come to grips at it, but then realize like yeah, that kind of was stupid. But I still think at least initial reaction, Jones would piss them off more. Yeah, I agree one hundred percent with with uh, with Jose. It's gonna <laughs> Jones Jones is, if, with, Jones is gonna get everybody upset at least with if if, you, if they took Pitts. I think if they took Pitts, everybody would be sky high. They, there's a lot of people hmm. that really like love Pitts, but uh, if it, if it was Jones, that's the one that's gonna get the anger. And the angst, even Sewell to to an extent, but not as much as uh, Jones would. I see what you mean, because like no one really loves Mac Jones other than like his mom, his dad, Kyle Shanahan, and <laughs> how about maybe this, Nick Saban? Like that's it, right? That's it. I forgot to say because uh, at least if, I think also the concept of Jones probably was going to be there at twelve. Sewell and Pitts were not going to be there at twelve, right? Exactly. Likely. So that's another thing. Yeah. See, see, I, I feel like if the Niners did take Pitts or Sewell, they would get roasted by the national media. And the local media, they would get a lot of people would be mad. I think that they didn't take a quarterback. Um, maybe I could be wrong. I would love it. There would be a a segment of the population that think it was just the most galaxy brain genius thing thing you could, genius thing you could do. But I feel like every national reporter would just roast them. I mean, really. And I would like it, but I think I don't know. It'd be bold. It would be bold, and I think they would catch a bunch of heat. But really, either way. They would catch a bunch of heat. I'm glad I'm not in their position.